Hey folks, this is Raiko Windstorm bringing you today a stream. Never going to play Neverwinter. Um, Module 6 expansion was just literally released a few days ago. Managed to roll a, a new character. I'm pretty new to the game, so forgive me if I uh, uh, come across as a bit of a noob. Um, I've been playing it for pretty much four ish days um, of solid game time. Um, when I say solid, I mean sort of four hours sort of, uh, a week, sort of. of uh, probably nine till five uh managed to level my uh, guardian fighter to um level 60 he's currently level 62 uh got it into level 60 just before module six launched a few days ago uh i'm now focusing on trying to get him higher up and um, get him to 70 i want to get involved in the pvp kind of the game because i love pvp uh it's my favorite part of any game um absolutely gagging to have a go at that anyway um you can see my character uh here he is he's a guardian fighter in the world and uh Karen doing some questing and uh hopefully we'll have some people join us on twitch this is my uh mount which is a unicorn mount so it's probably the, the lowest cost in terms of zen unicorn uh, an epic mount you're able to purchase on the store uh, bought it simply because it was a way of i guess leveling up more efficiently so when running around in between quests from one place to another it's a lot quicker so hence why i decided to stick a bit of money in buy some zen and buy me a unicorn i like the character it's pretty cool it's pretty solid it doesn't do there's hardly any damage to be honest certainly not compared to other classes which absolutely wreck damage but um he's, he's solid he's hard to kill uh, and i think it does bring some value in pvp i've played so far even if it's just as far as holding points and um stopping others recapping points off of, off of our team so um, it's like everything it depends on your gameplay style depends what you enjoy doing um, I, I, I personally I'm up for a bit of anything I love DPS characters I love rogues I used to play World of Warcraft for years and years and uh, I played a rogue as my main and thoroughly enjoyed it uh, obviously rogues are quite similar in here very high DPS stealth etc um, but I thought I'd go for a tanky character this time, and I did. Obviously, there's a new Paladin class that's been released with this expansion. Um, they look they look good. They look very good. Obviously, you can go, you can go Paladin, you can go Healer, choice of either or. Um, heavy armor wearing, again, another uh, you know solid class. Um, I probably won't roll one just yet. I like to try and stick to at least one character for a bit, get them to max level before I start going crazy on ults. Anyway, I'm going to uh, let you watch me for a little bit. If um, anyone joins, obviously I shall have a chat to them. And uh, if you happen to be watching this stream offline, then obviously please follow me. And um, hopefully next time you can catch me when I'm online and uh, we can we can chat. And uh, if you've got any either advice for me as a new player, then amazing. If you're if you're a, a, a vet, brilliant. Um, likewise, if you're a noob or you're thinking about getting the game and you've got questions for me, then um, more than happy to answer them if uh, I'm online. Ah, oh, got to empty my inventory. Look at this, absolute chocolate block. Even my overflow's full. Say what? Get rid of this junk. Get rid of these greens. Greens are pretty much worthless, to be fair. You can see you can get two copper or um two bronze for a for a. Uh, green item that's obviously unidentified as soon as you identify it you can get more so if i show you for example take this necklace if i identify it suddenly we can get 10 silver probably is with that it's cost probably i don't know upwards of 50 60 astral diamonds to basically identify it which um is a false economy if it's just not worth the money so for that reason only i tend to just chuck them away unless i'm by a vendor in which case you can just vendor them for those few few bronze few copper um, but just as we're desperate for space, I'm going to clear them out, get rid of them. Lovely job. A nice chunk of space available. Brilliant. I saw I had a blue here. Now, probably see all my epics, which I've had to begrudgingly get rid of. I worked hard in the day that I had of uh, no module six to uh, unlock those epics and get them from dungeons. And now they're bloody useless, but never mind. Right, so I need to pick this up. Right, 
Um, you killed my cleric. Quite like my uh, companion, actually. <laughs> I will confess to one thing, though. I um, when I got him, I didn't quite really didn't know what I was doing, to be honest. And uh, it gave me a choice of picking a companion. I could pick like a fighter. I could pick a cleric. And there's a few others. I can't remember exactly what they were, but there's a choice. And anyway, I decided as a tanky sort of uh, aggro type class. I thought, oh, I'll get a healer. Uh, at least you can keep me up. I'll take the damage, slowly dish it out, and my healer will keep me up. Brilliant. And um, so I picked my character and everything, and it said, oh, name, enter name. And for whatever reason, I don't know why, mentally, I just thought cleric, healer, it's going to be a bird. Definitely going to be a bird. <laughs> so I called it Elvin, and as you can see, it's a guy. It's a young man. So uh, a young man called Elvin, which is a very feminine name. But never mind. <laughs> it's only a game. <laughs> Apparently, you can uh, re-roll names, and you can rename characters and stuff, or companions, but... Uh, the, the cost of that it's not really not really worth it you can just be called Elvin for all I care I'm not actually sure what I'm supposed to be doing for this quest I'm gonna head over to follow the uh, follow the trail for the next quest on my list probably gonna take me all the way to the beginning anyway love to get to level 63 tonight if we could that would be very good I've just realized we've got some proper old school music playing in the background, so please forgive me if it's not to your taste. It is randomly chosen, I do assure you. It's not personally my favourite cup of tea. Okay, I've got to kill these ashen miners and get work orders. Six out of eight, so I need two more, and they're in this blue, this highlighted blue circle area. Apologies for the state of the background behind me, if you can see on the webcam, this is my little spare bedroom that acts as a, an office and a playroom for a computer and everything else, so at some point when I have the spare funds or I get enough donations, I will be looking to, I will be looking to um, get me a green screen so that people won't have the pleasure of being able to see my messy office, which would be very nice, but we're a little while off. I've only started streaming probably for about two weeks now so very new at it then you know picking up things left right and centre learning new things every day and um, I figured I play games a lot play games regularly so I might as well whilst I play I might as well let people watch me and talk to me <laughs> which is effectively what streaming is at the end of the day happy to talk to people do it all day long for my job happy to do it at night whilst playing my favourite games um, if I can help people in game, great. If I can make new friends, even better. And if people can help me, amazing. <laughs> I had a really helpful chap on the other day. He was he was uh, uh, never went to bed, telling me all kinds of stuff I didn't know about this game. Stuff that I really should have realised, but <laughs> I did. I had no clue. But that was a really good experience as well. So it's a, it's very much a two way thing. If you're wondering what kind of build I am, um, quickly show you if we go into character and then if we go into feet, you can see I'm very deep into the protector tree which is, is great, I'm finding it quite enjoyable. Um, before module 6 released I was full protector, obviously there was a respect token which I've got as part of this module update, I haven't used it yet, I will use it at some point, I, I don't know when though. Um, I haven't tried Conqueror, I haven't tried Tactician, I get the impression Conqueror is DPS, Protector is more tanky, and Tactician is more team play buffing. Um, looks quite good actually, for sort of PvP, party PvP, I reckon that'd be pretty awesome. Um, but that's what I am at the moment. I'm going to let Module 6 settle, um, and I'm going to look around on the forums and guides and see, uh, let people play with the character, you know, the Guardian Fighter, and let them publish decent builds, and then once I've found one that I like the look of, I will, uh, at that point, I will respec and sort my build out, so it's probably a bit more efficient, because I started this build with no guide at all, I just basically picked what I liked um, until I got probably a quarter of the way into it, and then at that point I started to look at guides, and I realised that um, 
it was very sensible to kind of stick to some kind, some set path, some guide. And luckily, I was only a couple of points here and there out from the guide anyway, so it worked out quite nicely. But now with the release of Module Six, obviously, it's, and, and the change of certain stats like life steal and, and uh, regeneration and stuff, it's completely thrown things up into the air. Right, speak to the geologist. Let's go back. I really need to empty my inventory. No, it's the, it loves this little spot here. It wants to take me back here all the time. Don't know why. Okay, let's have a look at the map. Oh, that's why. It's because I've had that selected. I had a like a custom waypoint set which was screwing it up. So I've got rid of that and it's sorted it out. Another big tree like the one in Protector's Glaive. Nice bit of experience there, can't argue that, 4,800. All helps. Retake the bridge. Oh, that would be a skirmish, I imagine. Doesn't have any of no, no other quests. Good, 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 good. Tell you what, it was hard having to throw away all my epics. I, I, I literally, it took me what, a day or so of module six, of just before module six was say leveled up in a few days. Um, only had a couple of days left before module six launched, and I managed in that short period of time, I managed to get myself pretty much fully epics out mainly tier one epics, a couple of tier two epics, and bang overnight they are rendered useless as you can see i'm wearing green so i've still got some of those epics but basically uh, there is a main quest line and it it gives you this set here which admittedly is a cool looking set if you look at my character he looks you know he looks awesome but um yeah it's it's uh it's not quite that same feeling as having my nice shiny purple just, just want to take us I don't know. I don't know. I'll figure it out. Two seconds. Do you know what? It really helps if I le learn to read the quest. It says there blatantly, get the explosive runes from the crate. So what do I do? I'm there going left, I'm going right, wandering around all over the place, and sure enough, straight in front of my face is a big old bloody crate with some explosive runes in it. <gasps> bloody difficult. What a noob, eh? Right, anyway, so I've got that, so that's, that's gone. What do you want me to do now? Clear vents with explosives. Now, I saw a vent down here. Sure of it. Where I killed these guys. What move, eh? Right, anyway, so I've got that. What do you want me to do now? Two events, two places now. I saw a vent down here. Okay. I was right. That's one of them. Oh, Paul Clarence dead again. 
I know why though, it's because you'll see at the moment I don't have many um I don't have many or if any AoE sort of taunt abilities equipped. I've got tons of them in my skill tree that I can equip, but I just don't have them equipped at the moment. My skills are very kind of more DPS based and also more uh, PvP. I like to do some domination matches in between playing the PvE, PvE side of the game. Uh, and to be honest, I'm a bit lazy and can't be, to, can't be asked to keep changing specs. So I tend to just leave it like this and play the PvP, PvE like this. Hey Doodle, not sure if you can hear me mate, so I know most of the time you, you watch you uh, mute yourself, but you can. Hello mate. I'm talking to myself a lot because um, I'm going to broadcast this or, or hi highlight this broadcast after I finished and just post it up so it's one of the highlighted streams, so hence why I'm talking a lot and I'm not just being quiet and playing. It's not because I'm going mad buddy, well, I might be. Right, clear vents of explosives. I need to find a few more. Oh, they're easy to kill. Probably, uh, looks like a vent. Tuck around there, yep. That up, bleep. Love a bit of that. Go on, my son. Go away. Hello, doodle. <laughs> you live laughing at me, talking to myself, buddy. It's hilarious, isn't it? <laughs> no, you started. Oh, yeah, it's all right. I'm not going to be saying this. That's all right. You're, you are going to be live on this. I'm, I'm, I'm basically just talking to myself and, and uh, I'm going to, you know, after you've done a stream, you can broadcast it or highlight it so that it displays underneath yeah, as a video. It, yeah. So that's why I'm doing it. Rather than just being quiet and just having a very boring, quiet video, I'm just sort of randomly talking to myself. So if someone does watch it, they've got someone to listen to. How's your day been, mate? Fine. You had work today or? Oh. Fair enough. I did play some level into. What level are you now? I'm oh, I'm 65. Oh, you're still quite a bit ahead of me then. Yeah, but the quest has taken ages. There's just so many of them. Yeah. Yeah. Remember last oh. night we were like. Uh, we must have done that quest line, uh, all those repeatables, what, 30 times? And then, then 30 times. only to find yeah. that it was bugged. Yeah, I've done them now, so I've done about 50 times in that one. the next area, you've got, to do, you've got to do another 16. Like, really? That sucks hard, man. Are you playing again now? Uh, I'm, well, I was taking a break, I haven't been playing for about an hour, so. I'll come back on in a minute, but I'm, I'm in the next part. I'm quite well. I'm not, well, I'm a little bit ahead of you. Yeah. Get me. What I want to do is I want to finish the quest. I kill everything up for the quest, but then when I go back to complete it, well, I don't want to run into anything. But then I have to kill them before they die. Do they get any more interesting after those kind of um, the vigilante ones? As you do. So you've got to redo the other 16 that we did before. Yeah, it's interesting because I couldn't find it. I couldn't find that, that quest again. I went, I, I dropped it, like you suggested, ran back to um, Protector's Enclave and expected to find it. And it's almost like I had a completely different one. Yeah. And now I've got this quest line that's taking me to the charred woods. And I don't, yeah, I don't really know what I'm doing. It's <laughs> just, just doing random quests. I've I'll do that anyway. But once you've done that, go back to uh, King of the Shore. That's really okay. sad. A yellow one, not a blue one. Ooh, second blue item. You have nights like that, no blue items at all. And then suddenly within like 10 minutes, two of them. 
We realise they're going to be useless. They're like level 58. <laughs> yeah, they're, they're pretty crap. Friday tomorrow, mate. Woohoo! <laughs> so looking forward to it. I'm so tired this week. It's been a long uh, week. I've got to work. I've got to do a little work. I've got to do a lot of work. You work most weekends, yeah? Oh, no, I've got to do uh, college work. Oh, all right, okay. Is that because you've left it till like the last <laughs> the two days back? <laughs> yeah. Four days to finish, do a project. What's the project on? Six. Math. This is on Math. radiation. Oh, yeah, because you're doing. Yeah. yeah. So interesting. <laughs> I'll have a look at that. Pressure under the mountain is already subsiding. This must have been an area that I just completely skipped because this isn't part yeah. of Module Six, is it? It's not it's part of Module. Six. <laughs> <laughs> it's experience, isn't it? And it's easy, easy to kill mobs. Yeah, that's why I was level, I think I was level 63 before I even started there. Level 62. I would have skipped it there if I could. Go to Shadowfire Cavern. Ooh, missed it. Turn left here! There you go, got it. Ooh, that's cool, big fiery cavern. Did you see the um, Crowfall information that was posted? I think. Did you see the Crowfall stuff that was posted today? No. It was information on like a campaign and, and yeah, it was, it was kind of a bit more info on how a campaign would work and the map and the idea of like holding a fort and stuff like that and sieges. It wasn't like amazing, but it, it looked quite interesting. Did we put it up on YouTube? Uh... That's, um... Yeah, that's the one plug sign. Oh, these mobs are so easy, but they're obviously only like level 56, but they're ridiculous easy. Almost like three hit a boss. Mm. How big is this? Oh, it's not, not far, nearly there. All these mobs. another PvP match earlier, Doodle, and uh, managed to pull it back from a, almost a, a guaranteed loss. That was quite good. Sorry, this is on critical. In that video, they say about an ambush. The thing is, how does Guild 2 even know they're going that way? Yeah, exactly. That's It did cross my mind. It's like, unless it's broadcasting it. where it's got to be yeah, taken. Taking 
Yeah. Yeah, it looks it looks good, it does look good. Well, that's what we're trying to become accustomed to in the game came out with the real looking thing, but everything is real looking. Really Many people can accomplish it then. I just wish that they, they, they talked about the alphas being like a few weeks long, not even a few, like a week. I think we touched upon this last night. Wish they were almost a little bit longer. Yeah, they're almost a week. I think they're almost a week long. Yeah, they're almost a week long. Yeah, they're almost a week long. They've talked, there's no NDA on it, is there? They're talking about literally being able to stream and sort of promote it and, and, and literally from, from get the get go as soon as it's available. As soon as the alpha well, is if, if they're that confident in it, then. Well. I mean, they're only, by, by what they said like a couple of weeks ago, they've only just started developing it, so. It's good to see some help. I've been when are the alphas in? They've got to be a good three, or, three to six months away, I guess. Yeah. They only started developing it when the Kickstarter ended. Have you had anything okay. from Kickstarter or from them to say this is what you need to do to link your account? I've had I, the money came out from Kickstarter. I've had like confirmation saying it's all done and stuff, but I never had anything from Crowfall saying this is how you link your kind of pledge to our no. system. I think they. I, I think that's what it. they're currently working on still. Yeah. Right, I need to leave this area. As, as good as it is for killing things easy, it's it's too low. Yeah, if you do, I think it's Drowned Shore or something, isn't it? The yeah. quest will literally be there to go. Doing those quests again is mind numbing. Oh, I don't fucking handle that. Mind numbingly boring. So, the crap over there, I'm not even worried about my first and third. I thought that was a bloody bug quest in the first. Stupid game. <laughs> The second part, I think the uh, the thing, mobs are a bit more tankier. Wouldn't say they do more damage. But they still do the kind of same damage, but it's just like an bit more ch feel a bit more challenging. It's like one more unit. No, the same unit. The first part, the first part is more of it, and then they introduce like one more unit, more health in the way. Has a massive AOE as well, so I can constantly use my shift. I mean, yeah, jump away. Okay guys, I'm going to hand this quest in. And once I've done that, I'm going to stop for a break. Uh, stop the stream, I'll carry on shortly. But I hope you enjoyed what you see. Say, if you watched the video and you want to follow me, then great. If not, I'll see you next time.